Hey guys, I'm Shireen with Cook This. Today I'm making hazelnut pesto with grilled chicken. So stay with me, stick around because I'm gonna show you how this pesto is gonna last you all winter long. My chicken marinating in the fridge, just olive oil, garlic, just like I did for my flank steaks, chimichurri, same way, but I'm doing it for the chicken. See, it's a great little marinade you can use for so many other preparations. Now I'm working on the pesto. So in place of pine nuts, which is very traditional with a pesto, I'm using hazelnuts. Hazelnuts, a little fresh lemon juice, I'm gonna finish the zest at the end, garlic, a good extra virgin olive oil, and lots of fresh basil time for the pesto. I have all this beautiful pesto and I think I brought you into my herb garden before so I have lots of basil growing. So this is great during the end of the summer when I have a slew of basil. What I'll do is I'll make this pesto several batches of it. I'll individually freeze it in portions, pop it in the freezer and all winter long I have pesto. Toss it with chicken, steak, you name it. It's great. I don't love it with pasta though, I have to be honest, because I feel like this is so light, beautiful, and fresh. I just don't think it does, does it justice. I like it better with grilled meats, even sauteed chicken, steak, it's really great. So in my food processor, I have the hazelnuts and all this beautiful basil. You want it dry. So when you wash it, make sure you dry it really, really well. It's all about the olive oil here. Freshly squeezed lemon juice. We'll season it with salt and pepper. I'll give it a whip and through the feed tube, I'll run a good quality extra virgin olive oil. So my chicken's been marinating for about four hours. You can do four hours to overnight. Olive oil, garlic, lots of garlic. Minced, I'm just gonna season it with salt and pepper. I already have my grill heated, ready to go. We're gonna grill these up. Hazelnut pesto and grilled chicken. Healthy dinner and it is amazing. So important, don't overcook your chicken. I think we feel like we have to just kill it to death. You wanna cook it just through and it really takes about for a five, six ounce chicken breast, eight minutes. You'd be surprised, that's all it really needs. And then let it rest for five minutes and it continues to cook. So now I gotta go in and have a taste. Have you seen this pesto? This is gorgeous. It's so bright, so green. Look at this. How can you resist that? This is the pesto that's gonna keep on giving all winter long. You're gonna love it. So just individually put it into tight plastic containers, tight lid, into your freezer, take it out, thaw it, it thaws really quick. You can still make grilled chicken inside on your grill pan. You can have this all winter long. This is great. And hey, enjoy it now too. So for this recipe, go to the newspaper's website. And for more of my fresh and easy recipes, go to tweetneats.com. Going in for the concentrated bite. Hmm. Summertime.